Brittany Bosters is back in the kitchen with us. She is our Cooking With You guest this week, a teacher at Kimberly High School. Yes. We're so happy to have you back in the studio. Thanks, I'm glad to be back. Festive spring desserts, I love it. What are we gonna make right here? Well, this is a key lime cake, um, and it's really very simple, which is perfect for spring because we're all so busy in the spring with sporting and events and other things, summer coming up, so this is a great one. And because it's made in a bun pan, it looks impressive even though it's simple. And the reason it's so simple, it starts with a lemon cake mix. Okay. Um, so you don't have to worry about all the flour and everything else, just the cake mix, and then a package of lemon pudding. And then you just mix everything else in all at one time. Key lime juice, and that's the key here with this cake, is that key lime juice. Now that can be found in the juice aisle, the pre-made juice aisle, and so you don't have to find key limes and squeeze them all because that's a more difficult thing to do. So key lime juice, vegetable oil, water, and four eggs. And then once you have this all in the bowl, you just mix for two minutes until it's well combined. Okay. And then you um, place it in a bunt pan or a tube pan, which you want to make sure that that is very well sprayed so that it doesn't stick and come out and then the impressiveness of the bunt isn't, isn't there anymore because it's half in the pan. <laughs> um, and what's really great about this recipe is that you can make it a couple different ways with the glaze. Um, you, the glaze that's on the website with the recipe calls for butter, so it's a thicker glaze than what you normally would use with powdered sugar and key lime juice. And you could either remove the cake from the pan and then glaze it like you would normally drizzle the glaze over or before you remove the cake you can use it like a poke cake and poke oh, holes in it and okay. then pour the glaze inside for a thicker um, more dense cake for this for on tv i just i omitted the butter and just mixed together key lime juice and powdered sugar and glazed it and then dusted it with powdered sugar um, because it's just a little bit prettier that way. It looks awesome. Thank you. And I have to say the smell is my favorite because it just makes me think of spring, summer, that citrusy. Yes, yes, it just wakes everything up. And then how long are you gonna cook that for? Um, about 50 minutes, you wanna check it at 50 minutes at 350, um, test it to see if it's done and then continue on if it needs a little bit more time. And Janie put the recipes online too and I was talking to her uh, just a little bit ago, you said there are two things that you brag about. Yes. And my, what is that? My children and my cheesecakes. Her sister Molly and Molly's husband Matt say, I have to try her cheesecake. Tell me about the one you just made. Um, I just made one. I sell my cheesecakes at auction um, to benefit local organizations. And I, um, one of the buyers just picked up a raspberry almond cheesecake that stands about four inches tall. And that one actually won second place one year at the Little Shoot Cheese Fest competition. They have well, a cheesecake way to competition. Go. We're going to have to have you back and make cheesecake then. Definitely. That's for sure. And then we made an announcement in the 7 o'clock hour. Janie, mm -hmm. what was that announcement you made? Well, we have three wonderful children at home, my husband and I, and we are expecting a fourth in August. Congratulations. Thank you. And we have some pictures of your little ones that we have to show. They're yeah. so cute. Yes, Tell me are. about your kids. <laughs> this is Abigail. She's six years old and in kindergarten at St. Nicholas School in Freedom. And then I have a three-year-old, Melanie. Um, there she, she is, the little, little peanut. Stinker. Yes, she is. <laughs> and she's three. And then we have a little boy, Trevor, who is two. Oh, they are just adorable. Thank Congratulations you. to you and your family. Thank you. And thanks for being on the show, making these awesome desserts. And she made lemon glaze cookies in the 7 o'clock hour. I have to try one of those. Recipes are online. Don't go anywhere, though. Good Day Wisconsin will be right back. I can't wait.